All right, we're going to talk about SEO and what's really happening behind the scenes when SEO stuff happens. We're going to talk about crawling and indexing and optimizing. So this is, in some ways, kind of the key thought process for on-site SEO. The general idea is this. These search engines are out there, constantly on the lookout for the best content on the internet. Content that is authoritative, it's relevant, it's helpful. It helps in answering questions that users have. To figure out and find where that content is, search engines use these proprietary crawlers, sometimes called spiders or bots. They're the ones that are doing the looking. So they're scouring the internet, um, different pages of the internet, at different URLs, uniform resource locators, or which you'd probably think of as like, hey, what's the, what's the web address, right? What's the page? So these spiders are evaluating content across different dimensions to figure out how helpful, uh, authoritative, and relevant that content is. And as the spiders digest and analyze and store that content, it becomes available to show for future search results when you or I look for things in, say, Google Search. And that process of digesting and analyzing and storing the content, that's when the search engines are indexing that content, indexing. So Google... For example, Google Spider or Crawler has a name. It's Googlebot. It's just constantly out there scouring the internet. And understanding that that's what search engines are doing, our job as marketers, people working in SEO, is to help not just humans, but also help those bots, those spiders, to understand our content by optimizing our content at those different URLs. And that's where SEO comes in. So we need to understand what those specific page attributes are that we need to optimize. Um, we're going to talk about those things at another time, but for now it's just important to know that we need to know what they are and we need to optimize them. So here's what that looks like in practice. Here's our spider. It's going out across the interwebs and it's adding things into its library, its index, so that it is available to show when people search for things. So here it is. Search engines have spiders like Googlebot that crawl web content around the world. And this information becomes available to Google's index so that it is available to show on the Google SERP, the search engine results page, for relevant search queries. And when this, here's our spider again, and the spider's going out to, this is our web page, right? And we know that that web page, ultimately, we hope it's going to show up on a SERP for a search query like, like this in question. And the spider is going to be checking out this web page for a number of different on-page elements. Things like the title tag, the images, did you use all image text, links, and a consistent keyword theme. All of the SEO elements on the page should um, point to a relevant keyword theme that ideally is the, the keyword that we want to rank for. And that is how it works.